beautiful souls welcome back to my channel and if you're new here don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell so that you're notified whenever i upload now today i am having something special for you guys it's a glimpse into our recent self-care vacation in the stunning mombasa but before we dive in let's start our day with a dose of positivity in reflection from the scriptures you know guys i like to uh, quote the scriptures and it's because that is the source of my strength in the last video that i shared called inside mv lagos hope the floating library i showed you guys a mug that i bought there as a souvenir on it it's written be still and know that i am god so that scripture is from the book of psalms chapter 46 and verse 10 and it has been such a beautiful verse for me and every time i'm using that mug i am reminded that god is with me and that i should be still in the midst of our busy lives it's essential to find moments of stillness to connect with the divine and also to recharge our spirits so this scripture reminds us to be present in the moment to appreciate the beauty around us and to find peace in the creator's presence isn't that a beautiful reminder you guys now let's get back to our mombasa self-care vacation and our delicious mandazi breakfast mombasa is so rich in culture it also has a warm hospitality and it has stunning landscapes so that was the perfect destination for our self-care retreat and we explored the bustling markets uh, we went to Kwale, I showed you that video, and we learned about the Swahili culture, and also we soaked in the vibrant atmosphere, like I'll show you in the next clip here, uh, when we went to Fort Jesus. It was such a lovely dance and we really enjoyed it. On the night of 23rd, I whipped up a batch of mouth-watering mandazis for my amazing friends. We couldn't resist the aroma of these golden delights, so we saved them for our morning breakfast. And as the mandazis sizzled in the hot oil, we laughed, shared stories and cherished the simple joys of life. And now the breakfast was an absolute delight. And before I continue, let me just share another scripture that has just come into my mind. Proverbs 17, 22, it says, A cheerful heart is a good medicine, but a crushed spirit dries up the bones. So what a better way to keep our hearts cheerful than through good food, good friends, and memorable vacations like this one. You guys, I feel like I can. we can just go back. <laughs> For the mandazis, I just used what we had. We had some milk, we had some uh, uh, self raising flour, and uh, here I am grating uh, lemon and also some sugar. So the mandazis were so sweet. It was just simple, a simple recipe, but very sweet. And as I worked on the mandazis, my friend Lucy was cleaning up the kitchen for me. 